a million bar and bat mitzvahs. <laughs> <laughs> about politics ever because I would never win an argument you know I knew we were on the same side but um, <laughs> one day um, I don't know I was talking about Hillary but I was talking about how she dressed not her political views oh, and, you know and I'm thinking you know I mean she does wear pantsuits all the time even though probably very expensive but one of these days I like to see her in a dress and Bruce looked at me and he's like Really? <laughs> so, anyway, so um, his car was parked in the, in the, uh, on the street at Sloan's, and I, I had picked up a Hillary bumper sticker, and I put it on the back of his car. <laughs> and um, I don't know, I saw him much later, and he, I said, it is caught, you know, he, I said, um, how you doing, Bruce? He said, you're going to believe this. He said, somebody put a Hillary bumper sticker on my car. I said, I can't believe that. It couldn't be anybody who knows you. <laughs> but it was always so much fun to talk with him, always. Did you ever confess? No, of course not. No, I mean, you know, Bruce was tolerant in some ways, but <laughs> perhaps not that way. <laughs> You did always love talking to Pat. You I know. appreciated your... Yeah, we, we had some brilliance. intellectual um, conversations, um, and sometimes about religion, because he knew I taught um, um, comparative religion, and so, you know, I did know a lot about Judaism, and, and he explained so much to me that I didn't know and didn't understand, you know, and I tried to explain to him about Catholicism, but... <laughs> You know, no, he, he was he very, knew. he was very intelligent. I mean, very he knew so much, he and right. it was, um, that's what I missed, too, you know, because I see he was such a good person. Daniel inherited his brain. Yeah. Yeah. We'll have another, we'll have another Dr. Brannon. Yeah, one of these days. Okay, we're going to uh, say to Kale Mole, which is, uh, that's very to say, and... Thank you. 